ranked the second most improved province, the Limpopo metric class of 2022 obtained a 72.1% pass rate. The province had seen a downward trend in metric results in 2020 and 2021, but that has now changed. Among the top learners whose achievements were recognized by Basic Education Minister Njimu Tsekha on Thursday was Tepo Makwela from the Riboni School for the Blind in Ilem. The 18-year-old, whose efforts were also acknowledged by his province, hopes to study teaching in order to offer support to the next generation of learners. Ever since I became blind, I got exposed to uh, some of the most amazing, resourceful and dedicated teachers at my, at my school, uh, which uh, left me astonished. Other top achievers in the province are pleased that their hard work has paid off. To be honest, I'm experiencing an amalgam of different emotions. At the same time, I'm still shocked and surprised. And I, at the same time, I'm over the moon. So it's a mixture of different emotions. I'm very much excited. I cannot believe it. I don't have any words to express my excitedness. But then how I did it was I read a lot, I did a lot of hard work, and I was also praying to God that everything goes well during our finals. The provincial department believes its intervention plan, which focused on accountability, is starting to reap rewards. We started with the, in winter schools, we went with you, we went to intervention classes, we went to Saturday classes, we went to starting accountability sessions, one with districts and circuits and principals, but also focusing on poor performing schools and principals and they were given support. But one of the things that we commit to was that how do you make sure that there is quality teaching and quality learning. The province is now aiming for an 80% pass rate. Biman Baloi, SABC News, Polokwane.